Hey, boss man. Keeping me and the crew real busy lately. Glad to see the contracts rolling in. Like that. Doing a bloody good job too, gotta say. Just one thing though. You and your fellow pilots might want to dodge the enemy's fire a little bit, eh? Right? We're running triple shifts after some of these jobs. And I know, I know you're doing your level best under the circumstances. I get that, I do. It ain't easy. All I'm saying is, try to bring the mechs home with all their limbs still attached. That's not too much to ask, is it? No, it isn't, mate. It's pretty bloody reasonable, I think. Well, there you go. Some friendly advice on the house, Gov. Gonna get back to work now. Catch you later. Hey, Commander. Thanks to Spears' people, we now know we're somewhere within Inferno's current sphere of operations. However, we still haven't been able to pinpoint the location of their base. What we have learned is the name of the man who killed your father, the leader of Black Inferno. Name's Andreas Cain. He was loyal to one of the Marek factions for a while, making a nasty name for himself. He was responsible for several massacres as well. Of course, that was before he struck out on his own and set up shop as a mercenary. After that, his trail runs cold. Unfortunately, that means there's a lot we still don't know, like how Inferno became as big as they are, or who their current benefactor is. Andreas Cain. When we find him, Rihanna, I'm gonna tear him and his mech limb from limb. I have no doubt, Commander, but we need to find him first. I've been scanning the comms, looking for any mention of Inferno activity. Not ten minutes ago, I picked up a distress call from a nearby port city. They have come under successive attacks by a mercenary group, and are asking for immediate help. Sound familiar? Sure does. The distress call had this image embedded in the transmission. It's a map of the city and port. I think it's best if I drop you down here, just outside this farm. You can proceed from there into the main city itself and ensure that it's protected. The port is nearby, over here. That's where I'll pick you up once the city and port have been secured. Questions? Nope. Plan sounds good. All right. Get us where we need to go, Commander. I'll keep monitoring the situation. Roger that. 